there's something caught in the net. It's an evil mermaid. Every mermaid wants to be the most beautiful creature in her ocean. So I'll make my eyebrows look bright. Attach blue self-adhesive rhinestones to the end of your eyebrow. Add rhinestones over your eyebrow in a row. These eyebrows will even shine underwater. What did Good Mermaid come up with? She'll add light crystals as an accessory. Attach three rhinestones at different angles to the center of your forehead. Create lines starting from them using little rhinestones. Add two rhinestones between the eyebrows. This face art makes our mermaid look like a sea goddess. Look who's here! It's a baby stingray! It brought us some eyeshadow. Cut a stingray silhouette out of glittery foam paper. Copy the shape on white foam paper. Fasten the layers together. Slightly bend the fins. Make a dotted pattern using silver acrylic paint. Clean the cap of an eyeshadow container. Hot glue sea salt crystals to it. Attach a decorative seashell and a coral on top. And glue the stingray to them. The ocean gifted blue eyeshadow to the evil mermaid. She can make her eyes look even deeper, thanks to the stingray helping her. A cute turtle drops in on the good mermaid. Its shell is so sparkly in the sunlight. Put loose eyeshadows into an empty makeup palette. Add rubbing alcohol and press them down. Make a head, flippers, and a tail out of light clay. Shape a shell on the lid. Press in big rhinestones. Attach self-adhesive rhinestones. Coat the flippers and the head with acrylic paint. Hello, little turtle. What do you have for me? Eyeshadow in all my favorite colors? This shiny turtle gets one point for the good mermaid. No way! I won't let you win! Swim out of here! What a great day! Oh, the sea has a gift for me again! What's in there? It's a lovely coral! Outline a seashell on a face powder compact. Carve out the shape using a toothpick. Coat the seashell with pearly makeup glitter. Fill in the hollows with liquid cream eyeshadow. Make coral out of foam clay and hot glue it to the lid. Add a plastic fish. Attach pipe cleaners, seashells, and pebbles. Make it look like the bottom of the ocean. Apply blue hot glue to the sides of the lid so it looks like water. It's an underwater face powder compact. The coral is so beautiful. I need to retouch my makeup after swimming. Someone swims by. It's an evil mermaid. She's chasing her jellyfish. Cut broken face powder and take out the crushed part. Clean the bottom of the container. Mix the powder with pearly makeup glitter. Add some makeup glitter to the highlighter. Mix it well 
and place the mixtures you made into the container, making stripes. Add drops of rubbing alcohol. Press the powder and the highlighter down. Apply hot glue to the lid. Put sequins into half of a plastic ball. Attach the ball to the lid of the powder compact. Coat the joints with clear nail polish and sprinkle with pearly glitter. Hot glue ribbons to the bottom of the powder compact. Make it look like jellyfish tentacles. Hi, sister! But the evil mermaid isn't very friendly. And she has a very nice powder compact. The score is one to one. Our evil mermaid swam here from the North Sea. And she brought her EOS octopus along. Take an empty EOS container. Add different kinds of makeup glitter to lip balm. Melt it in a microwave. Turn over the lid with a grid and pour in the lip balm. Refrigerate it until it sets completely. Make octopus tentacles out of polymer clay. Shape pink balls into suction cups. Press in hollows on the suction cups with a modeling tool. Bake it following the package instructions. Scrape an eye on the hardened surface of the lip balm. Melt lip balm with black makeup pigment and pour it into the hollow. Paint the US container purple and coat it with clear nail polish. Attach the EOS to the tentacles. This EOS octopus always takes care of my lips. His tentacles are so cute. He's a real friend. The Good Mermaid also has a beloved pet. A lipstick fish! Shape a lipstick to look like a long seashell. Add details with a toothpick. Use a brush to apply pearly makeup pigment to the surface. Set a plastic partition between the tube and the cap. Wrap the container in light clay. Shape a fish with fins. Add a tail. Attach sequins as scales. Coat the fins, the tail, and the head with pearly acrylic paint. Attach a rhinestone to be an eye. Add details with a marker. Wipe the pattern off the lipstick tube using rubbing alcohol. Check out my fish, sister! It has a seashell inside! Let's do our lips! But Evil Mermaid's Octopus is rarer! The Evil EOS wins! The score is 2 to 1! Now we need some brushes! Let's get them out of the water! Hot glue an eyeliner brush to a long seashell. Use a dry brush and pearly acrylic paint to color the seashell. A brush made out of pearly seashell? This isn't very impressive! Take this crab, you smart aleck! Shape polymer clay into a crab claw. Join the parts. Shape it with a modeling tool. Bake it following the package instructions. Add accents with gold acrylic paint. 
paint dots on the cloth. Attach an eyeliner brush. Ah! Keep your claws to yourself! It turns out that this crab claw is used for makeup. Let's try doing each other's makeup. Yellow is for the good mermaid. And the cold shade is for the evil mermaid. This round is a tie. So it means that everyone's a winner in this makeup battle. Did you like our mermaid makeup battle? Let us know in the comments whose makeup you liked the most. Good mermaid and her warm tones or evil mermaid and her cold colors. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell so that you don't miss new mermaid ideas from Troom Troom.